Hello everyone, welcome back to Leeton. And if you've been following the channel for a while, you'll know that I'm trying to review and test the Yangle propagators with the little LED uh, lights in the top. So propagators like this that you can get on Amazon and other places. And <clears throat> I've run an experiment already, and you can go back and watch videos on that. But it wasn't conclusive, and I think that was because of the way I set up the experiment. So today, we're going to rerun the experiment, but in a slightly different way. And basically, I've, I sewed a couple of weeks ago, two trays of marigolds. And I grow marigolds because I like to plant them amongst the veg and things, and I like marigolds. And here they are, germinated and doing well. They've been there on the windowsill. It's a lovely, warm, light room, this. So they've been doing very well over there. And the experiment is going to be one tray over there by the windowsill. So I think I will put the tray with the most seedlings, which is this one, by the windowsill. And the only reason I'm going to do that is that, that I have more confidence of them being good plants by the windowsill within this night light, nice light room. And that gives me the most yield. So I'm not wasting any plants doing the experiment. So they can go back there. And this tray, I'm going to put in this cupboard up here. So I'm going to leave them up there with the propagator lid on and the lights plugged in and that cupboard will stay closed. So they're not getting any light from here. But to do that, I've got to get the cable in there obviously and this unit isn't precious to us at all. All of this worktop and this unit will be coming out of this room because we will turn this into a conservatory type room with some seating and what have you. That said, I will be using it every spring and uh, late winter to get my seedlings going. So without further ado, I need to drill a hole in here so that I can get the cable through. Go. More mess for me to clear up. So, I've got the, the uh, light system set up here. So, I'm going to poke. I might actually put them all through and just plug the one in. If that's possible. and get one of the propagating lids with the LED lights on and put that tray in there and plug in one of the wires and then turn the unit on setting Let's see. there we go blue and the blue setting is 12 hours so in theory at this time of the year these plants will be getting more light than the ones by the windowsill. That said, 
the light by the windsill I would imagine is a lot stronger and is as nature intended it whereas this is obviously artificial but the experiment will decide if these lights are anywhere near close to daylight so I'm going to move the camera and give you a close up of this now there you go it's set up in the cupboard the lights are on and it doesn't matter that I've turned these lights on at uh, well, about half past one in the afternoon because this is a, a closed cupboard so they can be on in the day or at night it really makes no difference um, and those ones over there will do the thing in the daylight obviously so that's that we're going to close that now and we're going to leave it let's say a week and we'll come back and have another look. Today is the 9th of February, so we'll see you in seven days and we will compare the results. Thanks for watching. If you've enjoyed the video, please subscribe to the channel. We've got a lot of videos coming up and I'll see you on the next one. Cheers.